In this video, I'm going to show you every shortcut that I have for Better Touch Tool. So let's get right into it. So in Better Touch Tool, you can choose what your input method is for each shortcut. So let's start with my trackpad. Corner, force, click, bottom left to launch, launch pad. Three finger tap, brightness up. Corner click, top right, start Siri. Four finger tap, keyboard illumination up. Four finger swipe down, keyboard illumination down. Three finger force click, brightness all the way down. Triangle swipe, bottom left corner, open finder. Corner force click, bottom right, launch find my. Corner click, top left, activity monitor. Shift, scroll up, volume up. Shift, scroll down, volume down. Four finger click, hide app under cursor. So those are all my trackpad ones. Next, let's do keyboard shortcuts. For keyboard shortcuts, I have a lot of command shift and then a certain letter to open a specific app. So let's go through them real quick. Command shift P, launch pages. Command shift Q, launch QuickTime player. Command shift N, launch NordVPN app. Command down, show desktop. Command up, mission control. Command shift S, launch Steam. Command shift W, launch parallels desktop. Command Shift M, launch music. Command Shift K, launch keyboard clean tool. Command Shift C, launch Google Chrome. Command Shift D, launch Discord. Option R, launch sound in preferences. Option I, launch Apple ID in preferences. Command Shift H, go into presentation mode. Now let's look at automations and named and other triggers. For this one, I just have it so that if I right click the green maximize radio button here, it will hide the current application. Here's another one you can do with the window buttons. I'm going to create a new, I'm going to go to window buttons and click actions. I'm going to go to left click red window button, which is a normal click. And now I'm going to assign the action. I'm going to search quit quit app under cursor. So if you're the kind of person that came from Windows and wants the red X button to quit the app, there you go. So that's all I have, but there's so much more you can do with Better Touch Tool. You can have shortcuts that utilize the touch bar, stream deck, magic mouse. You can have a Siri remote, MIDI triggers, drawings, and even interact with the notch. 